Hello friends, it's me, Carol, and don't be alarmed, I'm here covering for Marcos on Tuesday, you'll see him on Thursday. We're talking about our celebrity fight scenarios this week, like which celebrity we would love to get in a fight with, and how we think that fight would go. Now, we're treading on, you know, turbulent water here, because you know, saying you want to get in a fight with a celebrity, but I'm going to go ahead and tell you, I'd like to get in a fight with Ann Coulter. Now, as a feminist by nature, I'm disgusted with the idea of violence towards women. As a pacifist, I'm disgusted with the idea of violence towards anybody. I wish we lived in a peaceful world. That way, Ann Coulter couldn't see it coming when I came and hit her in the mouth. You see, that woman says some pretty hateful vitriol on a regular basis. I have never heard her say anything that didn't tie my stomach in just... I think I could win. Now, stats alone may seem a little uh, misleading. Ann Coulter's got like a foot of height on me. She weighs 145 pounds, or at least she did in the early 2000s. I am about five foot two, and my weight is none of your GD business. But it's enough that I have a lower center of gravity than her, which makes it very hard to knock me over. Also, I can take a hit or two before I go down. I feel that if I got a rush in at Anne, I could knock her down and do enough damage to where they'd have to wire that harmful yap of hers shut. Hmm. Now, before anybody decides to alert Miss Coulter, I don't think anybody here will, I just would like to say I'm utilizing free speech. This isn't a threat. I'm not saying I'm going to find Ann Coulter and smash her face into the ground until her jaw breaks and they have to wire it shut. I'm saying that I wish I could. I'm saying I would love to hit Ann Golter. I'm saying that of all the damaging public figures out there in the world who try to hurt the cause of women's rights, Ann Coulter is the most pernicious. Because for every misguided male politician who says something that women in general find offensive, Ann Coulter grants some validity. Because, well, we can't all be thinking that you're wrong. Because we got Ann on our side. Ann, your woman card has been revoked. Because you're against us. Anyway, see you next week, friends. And I hope you have a good week. And I hope that the rest are a little funnier than mine. Uh, so, see you next week. Bye.